Here's a quick explanation on lip taping. Why would we consider lip, lip taping? Is this a crazy idea or what? And the answer is no, it's not crazy. It can actually help a lot of ways. Uh, the nose is meant to be what you breathe through. When we breathe through the nose, we warm the air, we humidify the air, we speed up the air so it goes deeper in the lungs, we uh, breathe less air, which is really good because you get more oxygen, paradoxically, with less air, and you filter the air. Who would drink unfiltered water, so why do we breathe unfiltered air, which is what happens when we breathe through the mouth. So what can we do at nighttime to make sure we breathe through our noses? Here's what I do every night. Two inch, flexible clear, 3M tape. I just tear off about that much of it, not a huge amount, and I save this. Don't push it in there, it's hard to get off the next night and put it on the top lip right there. Roll your lips in just a little bit. Push it onto the bottom lip. There you go. I can even talk with it on. Yes, I'll pick up the kids tomorrow. Good night. And then there it is. But if, as soon as I relax my lips, I'm breathing through my nose. If I had to open my mouth, it'll just open. It's gonna either tear the tape or it's gonna uh, just come off of one side or the other. So if that doesn't work, or let's say somebody has facial hair right across the middle, you can actually go from one side down to the middle. Or the same thing on the other side, two of them. It would, if you're gonna do it on the side like that, it takes doing both sides. So there are various ways of doing it with the flexible clear tape. Some people will go straight across the middle. I don't find that that's an easy thing to get uh, people accept to, to accept doing, and I don't like doing it myself, so uh, I don't recommend it. The other option is to use the 3M paper micropore tape. And with the micropore tape, uh, you tear off maybe that much of it, fold in the end so that you'll be able, this is not cooperating for my demo, but you have to fold in the end so that it'll come off really easily the next night and so that it'll come off easily from your skin. So fold in the end just a little bit, tear off uh, about that much of it, and this kind, I cannot tape, I cannot talk while it's on my lips. Uh, you just roll your lips in a little bit. Mm -hmm. In the morning, take it off. If it's too sticky, just put it on your pajamas a few times to get some of the stickiness off, put it on your lips. That's it. You may wake up with it in your hair, on the pillow, or you know, just somewhere you don't expect it. I now have two patients that wrap it around their index finger during the night and they don't know how or when, but just keep at it and it'll eventually stay on all night. Before you do this the first time, what I recommend is try it for 15, 20, or even 30 minutes while you're awake, say in the evening while you're winding down, getting ready to sleep. Uh, it could be another time during the day too, but maybe while you're reading or watching TV, checking email, tape the lips and just let your subconscious work on the fact that the volume of air you get when you're nose breathing is adequate. It really is adequate. Now, you may have to clean out your nose. You have to blow it. Do whatever you have to do, a neti pot. Get it cleaned out so obviously you don't have uh, the night starting with your nose really stuffed up. But even though it feels like you're not getting enough air, in, in just a matter of a few minutes, the nasal cavity is gonna open up. It's a use it or lose it thing. If you use your nose, it'll dilate and you'll be able to breathe more air. If you don't use it, if you fall asleep, your mouth drops open, you breathe through your mouth, you're gonna lose your nasal passages because it's gonna swell up and congest, and then it's gonna be even harder. And that's generally how you'll wake up in the morning with the nose congested, the mouth dry, and with uh, you know bad breath and drool all over your pillow. You eliminate those things, and sometimes even a little bit of the snoring, if not all the snoring, it can make you sleep a lot better. So that's why we lip tape, that's how I lip tape, and good luck, give it a try. Comment below on how it works for you.